Joel Hawthorne of the Morning Snapchat is here for our final trade of the day. And Joel, you're taking an overall look at the market. Are you concerned at this juncture? Uh, concerned a little bit, I would say, definitely. I think right now uh, we're kind of in that consolidation range. I wouldn't necessarily say that uh, I don't feel like we're still in a corrective kind of trend, so to speak. And I definitely don't think the buyers are in control. I think we're kind of in consolidation. And for that, uh, it has me kind of a little bit cautious over the overall who's winning the battle of the market right now. Sometimes when traders and investors are concerned or cautious about the market, they tend to go to the safe haven place such as gold. Yes. Now you're actually looking at a trade in this category. So am, what are you I thinking am. about GLD here? Well, definitely, as you've seen right now, as the market has had some of these down days, Gold has definitely held firm and held strong with their numbers. Gold right now trading about 122 and change right now. Uh, and what I'm talking about in reference to uh, the ETF GLD, it's about 122 and uh, change trading right now. I think we can get to about 124, 125 by the end of the month. And for that, I'm looking at the, how the calls are priced out till about Jan 25th. The Jan 25th options expiration. That is correct. So what would be your call? Actually, the calls are priced fairly cheap. Uh, right now, the bid ask spread is about 30, 30 to 31 cents. Uh, so the ask is about 31 cents right now. So for that, I'm really just looking to kind of buy those calls out till about Jan 25th. And the beautiful thing about GLD is it's tracking what's going on with the overall gold futures, which is a much bigger chunk yes. to actually actually have to trade. Absolutely, absolutely. So this gives me a chance to be a participant, but actually those calls actually only cost me 30 cents right there instead of buying the actual outright futures contract or even trying to buy a physical ounce of gold for what would be probably about a little over about $1,200. And then what do you need to have happen here for you to make a profit? Well, I just really need for gold for that GLD contract to actually trade up to about 124 uh, or 124 above and then actually I can start to make a profit on those calls that I purchased. Check out businessfirstam.com to find out where to see our entire show. And don't forget to like, follow, and share Business First AM.